I've spent more than half my life in this company. I mean, dancing for 20 years full stop is, is a feat in its own and to be loyal and true to one company, um, I think is quite unique. If they could see me now, that I did start when I was really young, probably four, tap dancing and jazz. I never actually saw myself in a ballet company full stop. Ballet was never anything that I envisaged that I would be good enough at. I thought I'd follow the path of my mother in musicals. I did my first Aurora. I'd only been in the company 18 months. Terrifying, but I'd been rehearsed really well and it was a really magic performance actually. And then coming back to it years later, it's still just as scary. The partner that I've probably done the most work with is Robert Curran. We were promoted to principal at exactly the same time. And most of my special times in the studio or on stage have been dancing with him. So we've created something that we find that works for us and that we really enjoy dancing together. Doing a world premiere of a ballet is always a highlight for any dancer. You spend hours, weeks, months rehearsing a specific ballet. To dance a story ballet, that's where the essence comes from as an actress. When you mature and they're the things that you really want to aspire to perform. I want the audience to feel real emotions when I'm dancing. I feel very lucky and very blessed that I have been able to achieve both. I am a mother and still got the title of a ballerina. rehabilitation and the return to work I know is going to be extremely arduous with a body after a second baby but I'm a fairly determined person. There's been highs and lows throughout my career for sure and there's definitely been times that I've thought is this it should this be the end of my career now. I think you have to go through the lows to appreciate the highs to find that self-inspiration. sort of thoughts throughout my career is just see what happens, make every day and every performance important and enjoyable and never know where it can take you. I never envisaged that 20 years later that I'd be a principal dancer and still on stage with the Australian Ballet. That was not even on the cards, that's my wildest dreams. <laughs> I'd love to say he has got another 20, but um, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs>